Hello everyone, welcome to some basic tech and hope you are doing good. So today we will cover about how you can take remote Linux operating system from Windows. So let's start and doing all things step by step. So first of all, uh, you need to install XRDP application in Ubuntu. Then we will go further step by step. So I have already installed. Let me put you the same command apt install xrdp in the terminal window and then press enter I got the information that this is already installed and then just you also need to press the same command that I just put here and you will get it installed after confirmation fine so once you install we need to add user xrdp in SSL hyphen cert group. Once you've done it, we need to perform rest of things step by step. And uh, once you've done it, then we need to allow one of port that is belongs to this particular OS. So for verifying it, IP A and uh, our I, uh, network adapter is this and IP address is. 192.168.117.139 so we need to allow it and uh, just UFW and then allow and type command completely from then 192.168.117.139 and then to any port 3389 the 3389 port is for RDP so I'm just hitting enter and rule updated fine so we also allowed UFW as a firewall and then UFW reload for best results and then firewall not enabled so UFW enable firewall is also active now and then UFW reload again so it will reload our policies fine it's done and then UFW status so we can see our port number our allow condition and IP address is mentioned fine now we need to go to Windows section and take a remote and see how we can perform this fine so guys I started my windows opening system and going to take remote open RDP through search menu and then actually uh, my IP address got changed in Ubuntu opening system so I updated this IP address in firewall and then going to take remote again and uh, just let's see connect here and see what is the result and so it is asking for two accept and then click to yes okay asking to connect and then provide username and password so my username is Riman then password and then let's click to connect oh uh, okay so there are some of options but I'm going to choose xorg and uh, see fine so connecting to Okay, I think I missed my password. See, so I took remote of my Ubuntu system and uh, this is how you can also take. So I will also provide the same link where I, uh, you know, searched about these things. So you can uh, do it. And if you have any queries and questions, just let me know. And uh, I will try to solve your problems as soon as. and. If you like the video, kindly do subscribe, like and share. Thank you so much.